Welcome to Marvelicious Toys. We bring you news and reviews of Marvel toys, statues, and more. Because not all Marvel collections can be bagged and boarded. They're not just toys, they're Marvelicious. And I thought I talked to Justin about it. I wasn't sure if it was even real. On some of the Marvel Legends Facebook groups I belong to, they started talking about a new wave of Legends I hadn't heard about and hadn't seen up for pre-order. It's eight figures, one of each per in the case. It's a build a Hulkbuster wave. And we've had a build a Hulkbuster wave. <laughs> yes. But this entire wave is Marvel movie figures from older releases. So you get... Captain America, it looks like possibly from First Avengers, maybe? Not First Avenger, but the First Avengers film. He's really bright in his blue. Yeah, like the first suit that they, they made for him. Then War Machine. Yeah. Iron Man Mark 43. Movie Hawkeye. Without sunglasses. Movie Loki, who was a really hard-to-find figure. He was a Walmart exclusive 6-inch before they were called Legends. Yep. Movie Hulk, who was also somewhat hard to find. That's the more recent Age of Ultron Hulk. I think this is Avengers 1 Thor, because I don't see gold on his outfit. Okay, and short sleeves. Yep. And then Black Widow without the blue lines. I think, is this the first Avengers movie, Black Widow? Oh, I'm having a hard time even remembering now. She came with two heads at one point. Looks like slightly different paint apps if this picture can be trusted. Looks like there might be a little bit of a a gray on her side panel. All building a Hulkbuster. It's all repacks, but it is an entire wave of movie figures in brand new packaging because some of these were never released individually like Hawkeye. Yeah, this is this is interesting to say the least. And even they're doing something that I've never seen them do before. Black Widow has some interchangeable hands, which would take care of that weird fist on that figure that we always complain about. Yeah, I'm I'm very interested to see what's retooled, what's redone. Now, from what I've read, this is a UK exclusive wave, or at least a Europe exclusive wave. But I found a website called robotkingdom.com, so I have placed an order for this wave. Well, we should know in a few weeks. It says it's available in May. Yeah, it's going to be exciting. <laughs> Marvel Toy News has high-res photos of these figures with these Build-A-Figure parts. And the photography, the Photoshopping, the white background. Because prior to this, all we had seen was a grainy little thumbnail that you tried to zoom in on. And it specifically says, Exclusive Marvel Legends UK. Interesting. Now I'm, now I'm wondering what the packaging is going to look like. And if there's any variants to these. I'm very curious about variants. <laughs> <laughs> And this is a good way you talked about, you know, maybe wanting to get a, a second Hulkbuster. And here you go. You're getting it without having to rebuy that other wave. And per Marvel Toy News, this wave is being solicited to Asian countries and China right now as well. So it's real. And I ordered it's spectacular. it. spectacular. Yeah. And I wish it would be sold in the States because shipping was not fun for a wave of legends overseas. But man, yes. I'm really getting upset that they're doing all these UK exclusives. I mean, there was that five pack and now this and they're like different. Just different enough to make you crazy. It's not just a box. <laughs> Thanks for watching this video. You can see full episodes of Marvelicious Toys with more collecting news and reviews at MarveliciousToys.com. We also have thousands of toy and collectible photos in our photo gallery. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Until next time, make mine marvelicious.